door technique now that we have our new door. There's a button. Silver button, John. Here, let me have your finger. You touch the button. Three. Yeah. Diane will come on and she will say, good afternoon, or what can I do for you? Okay. And then she will unlock the door for you. You have to actually turn the handle. Oh. Did you see that? All right. There you go. Turn the handle. Open the door. We can't just let anybody in our building, yeah. John. Okay, so this say treat you guys. Yeah. Right. Okay. TV. We're so glad that you're spending your Sunday morning with us. Let me us. ask you something. Okay. Did, did you have trouble with the door your first time? Of course not. Okay. I, nobody did except for one of our staff members, and we won't tell who that is, but his name is Charlie Steger. Right. But we're not telling him. Door anything. handle. Right. Turn it. Use your muscle and your wrist. That's it. It's good. Okay. Right. What have we got? We've got lots of stuff going on, okay. as always. Let's start with the 18th of September. Women on Mission, they are hosting a World Craft Bazaar. You are going to actually get to come down into the Fellowship Hall after both services. You can purchase the items that are being displayed from people groups that have uh, made these things from all over the world, and it's actually going to help support those people and those people groups. So, um, great way to help. Absolutely. You know, help with missions, help support missions. Stuff. Yeah, absolutely. yeah, absolutely. I expect to see you in something tribal a couple weeks. Don't hold your breath. Oh, okay. okay. All right. Well. All right. Do you want it? I, I've got something. Why don't you volleyball. Go for it? Okay. If you're interested in playing volleyball, we need to get the teams lined up. Okay. We've got uh, this is the last week we're accepting uh, uh, teams into the league. So accepting? if you haven't, I have to yes, fill out an application to do. play. You do have to. You know, absolutely. Don't say that. People aren't going to play if they have to fill out an application. Oh, okay. Don't fill out an application then. Just <laughs> let me know. And we'll get you hooked in with that, okay? So okay. let us know this week. Volleyball starts. And volleyball. we will actually move the, the starting date back one week to uh, September the 20th. So if you'd like to get a team in, let me know. And I'll get those schedules made up. I heard that daycare preschool volleyball team had some real muscle on it last year. They did. I think they're coming back to, to Are they? Know, challenge yeah. again this year. Yeah. We had, uh, I mean, forget Rusty Cox. Yeah, he was on it. But, I mean, Bill Clark. Woo! <laughs> I don't know if he's going to play this year or not. Yeah, anyway. Okay. All right, so we also have DC4K getting ready to kick off December. No, not December. What? December. I'm ready for Christmas already. September 12th, Monday night, 6 p.m., DC4K. Great program, great, great ministry. ministry. If you know of a child that is going through you know, divorce and, and having some trouble dealing with those issues, this is where they need to be. I think it's for ages 7 through 12 or 13. You can definitely contact Melissa Willis or even Sherry Richter. Your wife probably has a little bit of information about that, either Goodbye. one of them. Either one of them. Melissa's kind of in charge of this, so if you have questions about that, contact her. Her information is posted all throughout the church. Okay. Yeah. I think uh, I think uh, Bill Clark and... You're going to send it to Bill Clark and John? And John Burdett. It's kind of a scary duo. Uh, I think so. All right, should we do that? Yeah. All right, let's go to them. Take it away. Thanks, guys. Appreciate that. And maybe scary, but hey, yeah. we're better, better together. Bill and travel uh, outfit, that'd be kind of yeah. cool. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> <laughs> Got some youth news for you. Actually, just a reminder about our Reveal Northern Kentucky Youth Conference coming up September the 11th through the 13th. That's going to be at the Simon Kenton High School Auditorium each night from 7 to about 8.15, 8.30 each night. It's, we're calling it a youth conference, but we're welcoming everyone. And it's going to be about the gospel of Jesus Christ and, and, and sharing that with the lost, but also an opportunity for us as believers to be mm -hmm. revived and get on fire for, for Jesus and uh, to, just be, to just really get real and, and hopefully see God send revival to our land and to our area. Uh, if you're interested in uh, maybe volunteering as a, uh, uh, a counselor during the invitation time to minister to students that are making decisions, 
and maybe you didn't get to make it to the adult training for that, uh, for the counselor training, but you'd be interested, just just contact me, and we would love for you to be able to do that and help us with that. Matter of fact, we uh, we want all the help we can get because we're praying for something big to happen. That's God's right. a, God's a big God, so we've got big expectations for what He is going to do. So remember that reveal coming up September the 11th through the 13th. Yeah, it's really exciting, and I've known Rob for years, and he's just an amazing, gifted preacher. Rob Turner, and our the, speaker. The teacher. adults who are going to be there, man, I tell you what, we're going to be just as revived as the youth are, I think. It's going to be awesome, and uh, really glad to see so many churches in the area involved right. in it, and so we have a uh, really, truly a Northern Kentucky effort here in doing that. So I also want to let you know, as you heard us talk about last week, that we're kicking off life groups again. On September the 25th, we're having an event called LifeLink. And the idea is that if you're not connected in a life group, uh, or maybe you've tried one and it's kind of fallen by the wayside and you want to give it another shot, we want you to be a part of that. Uh, right after the second service, we're going to have a light lunch and just get folks connected. And by the time you leave from that event, and only take about an hour, hour and a half, by the time you leave, you'll be connected in a life group to give it a shot. Mm -hmm. And I tell you, our life group ministry, I, I can't say enough about it. So many folks have been growing and serving and worshiping by being a part of a life group. So we want to encourage you to con connect with us by telling us you want to be a part of that. Uh, we have some blue cards in the pews at the Welcome Center. There are RSVB cards. Uh, that would allow you to communicate with us saying you want to be a part of that. So fill those out, put it in the offering plate, or leave it at the Welcome Center, make a paper airplane out of it, and throw it at one of us. We'll catch it, and we'll make sure you're going to be a part of LifeLink on September 25th. So make sure you be a part of that. What else is going on, bro, with the youth? Well, it's actually okay that Missy wanted to start talking about something in December. It's really, really a great preface for something I had to say about December. Actually. Awesome. Winter Extreme. I can't believe we're already talking about winter. <laughs> But uh, Winter Extreme Conference coming up December the 27th to the 29th. It's going to be a great time uh, down in Gatlinburg, Tennessee. Awesome. With some great Christian artists. We're talking about David Crowder Band, who's actually going to that their last their final off, tour. Final man. tour are going to yeah. be at Extreme, along with Toby Mac, Red, and all kinds of other great artists. And some great speakers as well. It's going to mm -hmm. be an awesome retreat, a great time for uh, students and adults as well that would come as chaperones and such to be recharged, revived. And we're really looking forward to that. The reason we're talking about it now is it's time to go ahead and start, start thinking about reserving that spot. As a matter of fact, a $50 deposit along with your registration form that can be picked up in the Deep or the Welcome Center is due on Sunday, October the 2nd. So you can go ahead come and, and soon. come and soon. Be here before you know, know it to go mm -hmm. ahead and get that locked in and ready to be ready for the winter. That's right. Winter Extreme Conference down in Gallagher, Tennessee. Already excited about that. Wonderful, wonderful. Lots of stuff going on at the Grove, and we just want to say thank you for being here to worship with us. It's uh, I'm excited to see what God's going to do this morning. It's a Labor Day weekend, and we're glad you're here to worship with us. So uh, we're trying to remember all this stuff. Take your bulletins home, and you'll remember it hopefully then. But push all of that aside for just a few moments and recognize that God is here with you, and let's worship together this morning. See you later. Have a great one. Bye.